Are we alone in the universe? Probably not. But where are they? For every alien enthusiast, there are five scientists trying to answer the Fermi paradox. Where are the aliens? To help with the search, here are five eerie theories about the Fermi paradox. Number five, they're already here. If aliens did visit Earth, they would be extremely hard to detect. Consider all the ways we can sense life on Earth. Light, heat, sound, radio waves. If a species is technologically advanced enough to achieve interstellar travel, they could also be advanced enough to cloak themselves from our detection if they're hiding in plain sight. It would explain why we haven't found any evidence of aliens or UFOs. It's not that we're not looking hard enough. It's that they're already here, and we're just too blind to see them dot for. The universe is a simulation. If we're living in a computer simulation, then the chances of us being alone in the universe are much higher. In fact, if the simulation theory is true, then the number of humans in the universe is exactly 8 billion. So far, so good. But there's a flaw in this theory. If we're in a simulation, then the people who created this simulation would have to be more advanced than us. And according to the laws of physics, information cannot be transferred faster than light. So how did the people who created the simulation get the information back to us? This is what's known as the simulation transfer problem. And for even more dramatic stories about the Fermi paradox, watch our full video.